Plot twist. The mRNA COVID-19 vaccine may have boosted immunotherapy in cancer patients. These patients with lung cancer who received the vaccine within 100 days of starting checkpoint inhibitors live nearly twice as long as those patients who didn't receive the vaccine. Melanoma patients, the differences were just as striking. Or when looking at a broader mixed cohort of different cancer types, risk of death was reduced by 27%. Yes, the mRNA COVID-19 vaccine seemed to have boosted immunotherapy against cancer. But how? Your body has trillions of mRNA coding for everything. But if foreign RNA enters your body, your body has sensors set up to catch invading viruses sounding the alarm. But it seems that the COVID-19 mRNA triggers a powerful burst from the innate immune system to release type 1 interferons, which creates a very inflammatory environment, which is very desirable when you have cancer cells that are hiding from the immune system. Checkpoint inhibitors can't do their job. The immune system can't get to the tumors. This very inflammatory environment makes cold tumors hot. T cells amplified, activated, and infiltrated the cancer cells. And when the cancer cells try to fight back with something called PDL1, the checkpoint inhibitors literally shut this down. The primed immune system is able to fight the tumors. This identified this in mice, but they then recaptured these inflammatory pathways in healthy volunteers who received the mRNA COVID vaccine and had blood samples collected at various time points. It seems like the mRNA COVID-19 vaccines primed the innate immune system that helped to make the tumors sensitive to immune checkpoint inhibitors.